the Leo and Danny show. Yes, play ball and go Yankees real quick. I just wanted to say that's wearing my jersey. They're playing the first game of the playoffs. All right. I Nobody cares say. about the God Yankees. Leo. Damn it. I knew you were going to say something negative about them. I just. Rooting to... for the Yankees is like rooting for Beyonce's album to debut at number one. That is, listen, they work hard. It's going to happen. They're a it's bunch not of... exciting. It's some pop garbage. <laughs> that's funny that you said. Well, look. I used to, I had I had stages with the Yankees. I was a huge fan when I was a kid. And then I was like, they're a bunch of fucking asshole millionaires. Fuck them, dude. And then now I'm back because I've seen people work hard like you and like people come go from ha- not having a lot of money to having money. And I saw what it takes. And, you know, I I sense that all, and I, and I do research on the Yankees. They're all fucking dedicated as fuck. They've they they've been having sex with average vagina I for so long. I guarantee there is no perceivable difference between how hard the average Yankee works mm-hmm. and how hard the average Oakland A works. Well, I yeah, I, didn't any, know one of the any, baseball any team. major leaguer, yes. But what the Yankees, what you can, if you can survive in the New York press, you have a mind of a fucking genius. Not a genius, but you're really a strong-willed man because the media is trying to get you to fucking say something juicy every single time you do bad. They really fucking pick at you and you just have to be like a strong-willed motherfucker so if you play for the yankees you got the biggest nuts so when baseball. you fuck up you strike out 10 times in a row mm-hmm. you bobble a catch in the outfield mm-hmm. do you have to stand yeah in front of a row of boom mics and start fielding questions about why you suck that game exactly in baseball in a game where seven out of ten times you're gonna fail anyway or more obviously nowadays i mean if you fail fucking seven out of ten times you're a hall of famer now, yeah, and you have to field questions from asshole little bastards that never played the game, yep. and they're like, "Why did you strike out that time for the third time? Like, what what happened? What were you, what were you feeling? What were you thinking?" And you just, you know, you look at this fucking guy, and you want to be like, "How about you shut the fuck up, Steve? You, you don't, you couldn't hit a fastball if your life fucking depended on it, you little pipsqueak." Fuck yeah, but you can't because then if you do that, then the next the headline in New York Post is. Garrett Cole is losing his fucking mind. You know, I don't know. But yeah, that's what they do. It would be like after every time I put out a video. Right. Everybody who hated the video paraded into my living room and I had to sit there and listen to why they hated it. <laughs> and I couldn't that. talk back. Oh, my God. I couldn't explain myself. Imagine that, dude. Yeah, exactly. Let's make that a video. Okay, let's do it. Okay.